Hi and welcome back to another Crypto Dave video. It's Friday which means another crypto interest rates and news update. Today is the 22nd of January 2021 and as always we start by taking a quick glance at any uh, changes to interest rates, any new coins, anything like that and I suppose the um, only real kind of changes that I've noticed over the last week have been with Celsius Network. Now um, I suppose the big news is that the interest rate on Celsius token itself has dropped below uh, 5% down to 4.86%. Uh, the rate for Ripple as well, uh, XRP rather, um, has dropped to 2.5%. Uh, so um, I think this is obviously due to a lack of institutional demand for XRP now with the uh, pending SEC investigation. Um, you can still get um, over 5%, a uh, base level of 5% on Nexo up to 8% with the earning Nexo and if you're a platinum kind of member uh, of that. So that's uh, probably the best bet for XRP at the moment. I don't know how much longer they'll be able to kind of offer this for. Uh, but yeah, uh, rates reduced for XRP. Um, I think the Ethereum rate uh, reduced a fraction as well and some other small changes. Now, uh, Celsius Network do change their rates uh, almost on a weekly basis. They're normally not huge changes, but there are uh, lots of little kind of tweaks on a weekly kind of basis. So if you do have coins in Celsius and you haven't checked the rates uh, for a while, make sure you go in and do that. It may well be uh, worthwhile for some of those to be moved to other platforms uh, such as uh, Nexo. So uh, yeah, if you've got coins in uh, Celsius, make sure you keep a uh, frequent eye on the kind of rates just in case they have changed. And then um, moving on to the token prices this last week. So um, I suppose the standout performer has really been kind of Nexo. So down 0.6%, everything's kind of down. But considering how much uh, Bitcoin's been down in the last few days, I think um, essentially kind of flat over the last seven days is pretty uh, positive for Nexo. Uh, Celsius Network has lost 18% over the last seven days. Um, now, those of you who follow my uh, passive income updates will know that I sold out actually out of my Celsius uh, token um, sort of at the end of the year. And I, I it was quite lucky in that it kind of coincided roughly with an all-time high, but it felt like the kind of, um, it had got a little bit hot, I think, the price of kind of Celsius. It was it was up um, over $5.50 and $6 odd uh, for a little kind of while, and it felt a little bit overheated, I think, the kind of market. Um, so I actually kind of sold out of all my uh, Celsius tokens. Um, the timing was... Um, all, Looking at the kind of like the price of the net, um, the price of the kind of token, looking at um, uh, the market and stuff like that. But also um, at the beginning of last year, I did say that I would hold my Celsius token throughout last year to see how it compared to being paid in kind. And obviously, it worked out uh, fantastically for me uh, last year. I think the sort of nine hundred odd dollars of interest I earned from Celsius uh, was worth ten and a half thousand dollars of Celsius uh, by the end of the year. And then uh, moving on to crypto.com, uh, down 3.6%. Again, not a massive loss considering what's happened to uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum and some of the large kind of alts over the last uh, seven days. And then moving on to some stories this week. Uh, first news is crypto.com. So they are listing uh, Theta Fuel on their app. It's now available as of uh, yesterday it was available. Um, you can buy it through the kind of app. Um, and uh, Theta Fuel is basically it's the sort of secondary token of the Theta network. So it's their um, gas token the equivalent of something like kind of gas on NEO and it will be used um, to power on-chain uh, transactions um, payments to relays and stuff like that uh, so Theta Fuel now available on crypto.com's app and uh, talking more about crypto.com uh, if you are using the app the exchange or any of their services be aware that there is a large uh, system maintenance coming out uh, coming up on the 25th of December uh, so in three days time uh, and that will be out potentially for um, uh, two hours but uh with all these kind of things, you know, um, be prepared for it to um, to last substantially longer than that. It should be two hours, but you know, if it does last four or five hours, make sure that you're not going to be relying on them later that day, in case it is de um, delayed a, a little bit. So, uh, as you can see here, Crypto.com at the exchange and the pay checkout all will be uh, affected during the maintenance. So, hopefully, that goes smoothly. Uh, moving on to BlockFi. Um, this uh, I noticed yesterday. So, BlockFi have launched an OTC desk for institutional and UN, uh, sorry, UHNW clients, that's ultra high net worth individuals and not just high net worth, but ultra high net worth individuals. Uh, and this is quite interesting, I think. I think this is um, 
something that's been coming for a little while, but um, uh, really kind of like um, feeds into the kind of narrative that we're going to have a really good year this year. Um, institutional demand, ultra high net worth individuals, and this OTC desk, over the counter trading desk, uh, will be available. It's 24 7 uh, support. So it's available, it's going to be in the US and Asia. So that will be covering uh, all the time. Uh, time frame so it'll be available 24 7 for institutional and ultra high net worth uh, clients so uh, I think this is really kind of positive um, I think it will do uh, substantial uh, volumes um, this year coming so I think this is a really uh, a really positive step for kind of uh, BlockFi and they have been doing quite a lot of stuff uh, particularly on the institutional size um, with their uh, tie-ups with Fidelity that we talked about a couple of weeks ago and other bits and pieces um, in other news um, those of people who have have been using Celsius and desperately waiting for a web app which uh, like myself really you know I use the the app on my kind of phone but you know I would love a website uh, a web app that we could utilize for that uh, I far, pre far prefer that to the kind of uh, to the mobile kind of solutions uh, it will be previewed on today's AMA so this is um, linked in the description below as with all the stories but in today's AMA I believe Alex will be demoing uh, their web app I believe when it comes out it will be initially for platinum um, level kind of members uh, but then we'll be obviously rolling out to everybody in uh, the um I suppose the uh, subsequent kind of like uh, weeks and months but uh, yeah if you want a, a sneak peek uh, check out the AMA today and you will be able to see that um, in other news um, somebody kind of like has been asking me about this a few times so I, I said I kind of mention it uh, Celsius Network have a shop uh, if anybody from Celsius is watching this feel free to send me some um, samples um, but they do um, the usual kind of like kind of t-shirts hoodies hats bits and pieces uh, like that they've got their hodl ones uh, let's just jump over to the t-shirts have a look what they kind of got so they've got the hodl ones in black and kind of white they've got their unbank yourself um, t-shirts uh, banks are not your friends quite a cool one um, and very other bits and bobs and it's not just t-shirts they've got joggers and jackets and and, and hats and accessories they've got like kind of mobile phone cases and stickers and bits and bobs like that so if you're um a big fan of celsius you can jump to uh, jump to the shop shop.celsius.network and grab yourself some goodies a lot of people seem to be posting a uh, picture of themselves in this uh, in their gear on the uh, twitter feed and then uh, finally uh, just next so so uh, Nexo seem to be pushing their crypto credit lines quite a lot at the moment. Now I have in the past uh, warned a little bit about kind of uh, Nexo, particularly if you're taking quite a high leveraged um, uh, loan from them, because I do know people that have been kind of liquidated uh, in the past. But they're obviously pushing their um, their crypto back loans, their crypto credit lines quite heavily. I got an email uh, the other day. It's um, it's not replicated in a blog post, so I can't send you a link to it. But basically, it's um, it was saying, oh, you know, why would people want to kind of like use our instant crypto credit lines? And they were sending ideas so um, hodling um, growing your investments the uh, billionaires approach what they term the billionaires approach which is um, basically kind of leveraging it to pay taxes um, as well as kind of big purchases so um, they're, they're pushing it quite heavily at the kind of moment um, I don't know whether that's a, a good thing or a bad thing I think when you know people are desperately trying to get you to kind of sign up for a project maybe it's it's more indicative that they haven't been as uh, as popular as they kind of hope they were um, the rates can be um, reasonable um, particularly if you're one of the um, one of the kind of higher rates if you've got one of the kind of premium kind of like accounts the amount of nexo you hold is a uh, pretty high uh, the rates can be um, pretty decent comparable to those on kind of Celsius and other kind of platforms um, but as I've mentioned before do be aware with any kind of platform I'm not um, criticizing uh, nexo specifically but it is just one of the platforms that I know um, particular instances of people actually having been um, kind of like kind of closed down of kind of positions when uh, crypto has dumped and obviously over the last um, a few days we've seen a big drawback in the kind of price of uh, Bitcoin from um, over 40,000 a few days ago down to sort of 30,000 I think just a few dollars uh, below that even um, over a kind of couple of days so um, if you were leveraged with a really high loan to value um, you know there is that kind of risk with any kind of platform that you can um, be kind of stopped out and um, and they will liquidate your uh, position so um, be aware of that but um, if you are interested in um, crypto back kind of loans I'm going to do a full video comparing all the different platforms so Nexo, Celsius, BlockFi, and you know etc etc uh, in the uh, next couple of weeks so keep an eye out uh, for that uh, that's it for this week thanks very much for watching as always if you could give me a thumbs up uh, post a comment share the video anything like that that would be fantastic uh, I hope you're keeping safe and well look after yourselves hopefully I'll see you on the next video but until then have a great day bye bye